to diversity with Delilah. <laughs> yes, sir. And this is Women's History Month, the month of March. If you didn't know, now you know. And Delilah has been bringing us somebody each week that has made some kind of impact either in sorry. women in, in the female in that community. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know if, I'm, if I'm saying wrong, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'll, no, I'll, you're I'll, good. <laughs> <laughs> Let Sean talk. No, here Let we go. Talk. Here's the Lila, all right? <laughs> you got it. You got it. <laughs> uh, no, that's so funny. You know, it's funny because when you said <laughs> when you said that, if you don't know now, you know. I just think about Biggie. <laughs> yeah. If you don't go now, no, you know. Now you know. No. Bleep, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's all I think of. Yeah. All right. <laughs> That's what I think of. But anyway, <laughs> I was just watching a documentary on Netflix. Sorry, that's why. I saw that. I didn't see that. Yeah. All right. So uh, today, I'm going to talk about um, Jen Welter, who is already like a big like female coach already in um, the American like football league, which, you know, it's like the other like arena football, that other type of stuff. That we <laughs> uh, anyway, so anyways. She actually graduated from Boston College, and she has a, a master's degree in sports psychology and a PhD in psychology from Capella University. So not only is she like a like you know a, an amazing like sportswoman, she's a you know she's brilliant because she's got like her master's and her PhD. Um, so this is how she started. She was the defensive coaching intern for the Arizona Cardinal during their training camp and their 2015 preseason that made her the first official female coach um, in the NFL um, because she was the first one to kind of start that program, the, the internship program that kind of the NFL had launched to try to recruit um, more women to be coaches and things like that. Um, so they hired her as the assistant coaching intern for training camp and uh, it expired in the beginning of the the you know the the regular season. Uh, she actually played rugby at Boston College. <laughs> yeah, she played rugby, which I don't know if y'all know what rugby is, but that is like hardcore, like soccer on steroids, kind of how I see it, because like they really like you know lay into each other. Um, she's a two-time gold medalist, a four-time world champion uh, for the international football. So she uh, the uh, World Championship Football League of Women uh, that inaugurated in 2010. So she's been kind of, so she's been around like playing football. As I said, she's played rugby. Um, they even had her like start as running back in 2014 for the Texas uh, Revolution. So she also you know played a little running back there for a little bit. Um, so uh, Jen Welter is someone that a lot of like women, especially women coaches, look up to because you know she kind of knocked down like that door right kind of start uh kind of broke down that barrier and door of like being in a male dominated uh sport and like she knows her stuff right like she actually like plays sports right she's been coaching uh she's been coaching since like 2015 for the atlanta legends mm -hmm. and uh which is a uh, part of the alliance of american football league that's the league um and so uh that's basically what she's doing right now. She's still a uh, defensive specialist um, under their head coach. So uh, currently um, she is still um, coaching football. It's just not in the NFL. But again, she is credited for kind of uh, breaking down a lot of barriers for women in the NFL because uh, she not only knows the, has the knowledge, she's actually played the game and like she's like, you know, really knows her stuff. And a lot of the coaches and people of the, you know, the different teams that she's um, worked with, worked for, really acknowledge her, um, her savviness in, in the game. And so hopefully we'll see her back in NFL someday. Maybe the first female head coach. Who knows? Because she definitely has the experience. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, you know, it's like, so who knows? Maybe she'll get a head coaching gig in the NFL, which would be amazing. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be perfect. So, uh, but yeah, so that's Jen, you know, that's Jen Welter. So uh, I was not expecting to see that she played rugby. Like, <laughs> uh, right? hey. like word? That she's like, oh. a tough, tough woman. <laughs> rugby yeah, is no man, joke. Rugby is no joke. <laughs> yes. Not a joke. 
<laughs> you know, you know, uh, I'm not stepping up to you because I yeah, and, 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 you know, <laughs> and the fact that she played for Team USA, as I said, the International Football uh, a Football League for Women, and that she won two gold medals, part of that team. That's you know, that's pretty stellar. So. <laughs> Kudos, Jen Walter. Like, yeah. keep shining, yeah. keep breaking totally. down barriers, keep doing your thing. <laughs> Absolutely, that's like awesome. That. Yeah. Shout yeah. out, shout out to Jen Walter, uh, rugby player. But I love that. I love that because she was the one. You know, Delilah. We had talked about this last week. How you know you need to have one, even if it's them just getting their foot in the door. Somebody mm -hmm. that's just opening and making a way for others to come after her. And I'm glad she got she got spotlighted because people need to hear about that. People need to hear about that for sure. People need to hear about that. Uh, but, uh